You can generate system level reports for CDIS Builder using the Reports icon from the main menu. When you click on it, it specifies three different kinds of reports, an audit trail, contents and prints, and traceability. The audit trail will search through all the data sets that are currently selected and generate a report giving you an audit trail of, of all the things that's been applied through the CDIS um, Builder tool. For example, there are for the CDIS Builder tool, if you look historically, there could be an add seek that's been applied or a variable length that's been applied. So the first column pertains to what um, the tool was applied specifically. And then there are input data sets, output data sets, along with um, any associated output path, programs, and reports. Now these reports also have hyperlinks. So if you click on the links, it will then open up a output, in this case it's a report on the differences. So a lot of these have hyperlinks as well. Now for those that are just path, it will open up a directory path containing all the data. So these are example links that you can link to either the path or the actual report item itself. Now the pr content and print presents to you a menu where you can generate either a proc contents, proc prints, or both from a specified path along with your selected data sets. Um, it will generate this report in the specified output location. So if you were to click OK, it's going to gr select these data sets that you've selected and generate that proc contents and reports file. Now in this case, it shows you the index of all the data sets you've selected along with a link to the proc contents or a link to the actual proc print of the first 100 observations. So this is a good way of having an overview of your data generating a proc print or proc contents. You can also generate this in the form of a macro call called contents and the same um, information that you selected from your user interface here is expressed in a macro. Now the last report is the traceability report and what this does is from your selected data sets it will generate a report showing you the traceability of of those uh, in this case this output data set here has input data DC which you can get a preview of along with a program that's used to generate that data set. So if you click on it, it will actually show you the actual program. So this is an example of where um, you can trace back in terms of what input and programs used to generate your specified um, data set. So those are the three different reports that you can generate from the reports tool.